Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel. My name is Helen if you're new here. Um, I have a Tesco haul for you today. So I did do a small top up Sainsbury's haul at the weekend. So I decided I didn't need to do a Sainsbury's haul as well obviously this week. So I've been trying to decide how I'm going to do my shopping because it's just not working. Um, so I'd got a Sainsbury's delivery um, saver which I've had for years and it's great but there was things we wanted from Tesco's as well it was getting too much trying to go to the shop and pick up those bits so I got a Tesco <laughs> delivery saver as well because Tesco's delivery slots are so expensive I tried click and collect it was just as much hard work as going around the shop to be honest um, so we did that and that is what we did last week and it was fine but I ended up with two different delivery slots on the same day um, it was a lot of hard work and I don't know, it just, we spent so much money as well. Um, so I think I'm going to try what I used to do, which, because I'm topping up at the weekend anyway, is I'm going to get one slot on a Monday as usual and do one on a Friday or a Saturday as well, which is what I used to do for a long time and it worked quite well. Then we just didn't need as much stuff at the weekends because the kids weren't really here. Um, now I've got more kids at the weekends, so we need more food. So anyway, that is, I think, what I'm going to try. So this week is just a Tesco haul. We didn't get around to filming the Sainsbury's one. I'm really sorry, but there wasn't a lot there. And then um, hopefully next week you will have a Sainsbury's and a Tesco haul if all goes to plan. So anyway, um, if you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up and please subscribe as well if you're not already subscribed. And let's get on with the shopping haul. Okay, here is a Tesco shop. Came to £101 and pennies. I sent something back which was £2. This is £99, so I feel like I've done better this week because we have expensive items. Um, so I feel like, yeah, I feel like we've done a bit better. Um, I'm going to show you what we've got and I'm quite excited because I've ordered a couple of new things that we haven't had or the kids haven't had. So I'm going to show you those too. Let's start over here. So I got some waffles. We must have just had a really bad couple of batches of these because I thought they'd changed the recipe. They were horrible and now they're normal again. So I don't know, but I'm really pleased about that. I like to have them for lunches sometimes or dinner. Got two of the sister rolls because they're on offer. I got some hash browns because I'm going to make um, with these um, McDonald's McMuffins. Um, so I bought the patties this time. Sometimes I make them, sometimes I buy them. Some turkey bacon, and then these are new for us. We've not had these before. Um, I thought maybe they might be quite nice. So obviously if you follow me, you know that I said my youngest is supposed to be doing a gluten-free diet. It did not last. Um, being autistic, she cannot cope with the change. Um, so we are going back to normal, and we're just going to limit some of the gluten in the food she doesn't mind and keep the foods that are like her safe foods um so yeah that just didn't last even a week so anyway so that might be nice to try beef stir fry strips uh, i got a spanish style tortilla so sometimes i make omelets and things like that but i don't like making tortillas um it's just obviously a lot more work basically and uh, more things for me to do um, so I bought one of those diced trezo for recipes and then we've got some salt and fried chicken straws some scotch eggs over here we've got some strawberries which look really good raspberries and mango then we've got kiwi fruit broccoli mini carrots normal carrots we've got some mushrooms some double cream I don't know what that's for Amelia must have ordered that one uh, red onion this is another thing that's new to us not seen this before i've seen it on american shopping hauls but never ours these look amazing it's frozen frozen strawberries covered in milk and white chocolate so yes i said to amelia i'm pretty sure we could make these ourselves um so we will at some point but we just wanted to try those 
strawberry mousses for a change. I always buy chocolate mousse. I really fancy the strawberry mousse. So I got those. And then we got three of the smoothies. We've got mash, um, mango and passion fruit. The blue spark and a recharge one. We've got some of the Itsu Brilliant Chicken Ramen Broth. Um, that's got a really long date on it. So it's like a year. Um, so that can just sit in the fridge. Um, it does need to go in the fridge. The first time I got it, I didn't realise it was a fridge product. And I left it out for a few days. And then I had to throw it away. I uh, got some of the Super Smoothies Immunity ones. They were on offer too. We've got miniature potatoes really fancy and asparagus realize i haven't had it for ages so asparagus i think i said red up red onion got some lamb's lettuce and some baby spinach which is a huge bag i am going to try these so the dietitian was saying that she wants um my child to be eating lentils and stuff and it's not something i've ever really cooked so i decided to buy this microwave pouch and i'm going to make a bolognese with it i hope that works i wouldn't know <laughs> I hope it does. Uh, we've got a packet of cream eggs and some of the squares because they were on offer. This is another one that I've not bought before, but um, I was watching a few weeks ago, Donna um, had said about getting those and then making her own. So I thought, oh, I'll try those, see if the kids like them. Garlic powder, bananas, I've got a regular lettuce and some muffins. Um, Got some, oh, got my hair gets everywhere, man. Got some food bags, uh, mint arrow bubbles, and then we've got a little gluten free section here. So, gluten free tortillas, they are the kids' favourite ones. Got this granola, which again, kids really, really love. Another free from uh, syrup sponge pudding. These just sit in the cupboard till they get used, they've got good dates on them. Um, the hippies, I absolutely loved those last week. So whilst they're on offer, I'm stocking up. And um, the baked crisps. And then obviously we've got some free from bran flakes. So anyway, oh, I told you, I forgot. I've got a massive set of can of Cokes out in my hallway that I forgot about. So yeah, that add that into the haul as well. Let me know if you think this is a better price than last week's because I was a bit shocked with last week, to be honest. This week, I feel like I've ordered more frozen stuff than usual um obviously i know the smoothies and stuff really really add up and then um even this granola is about three pound fifty or something it's really expensive um you know we've got some nice fruit and veg this week don't have a lot of meat but i'm kind of i just don't feel like meat much at the moment um we've got chicken in our freezer we've got sausages in our freezer i think we might even have mints in the freezer. So I just want to try and get those things used um, and try and buy a little bit less. So yeah, um, let me know what you think. I might not do an actual meal plan meal plan because at the moment my head's still not working properly and thinking out a whole week. But if I've got dinner ideas, I'll just put it up on the screen or something just to let you know roughly what we're having because I've got a few ideas, um, but not a whole week's out as yet. So anyway... Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. Please don't forget to like and subscribe.